what is up guys this is another requested video of by a lot of my subscribers uh, so apparently you guys want to know how to go back to Windows Phone 8.1 say if you have a Nokia Lumia or a Microsoft Lumia which you upgraded from Windows Phone 8.1 to Windows 10 mobile but didn't like the experience because the software is still in the release stage and there there are a lot of bugs on it so particularly the, there's a bug on the keyboard which causes it to crash so you might want to go back to Windows Phone 8.1 and I'll show you how to do that so first off make sure your phone is 100% charged and that you have taken all the, the backup of everything uh, including photos music and videos on the internal memory contents on the micro SD card won't be uh, affected and by the way you won't be able to recover your text messages or your contacts because backup and restore on Lumia uh, on Windows 10 mobile isn't compatible with Windows Phone 8.1 so you're gonna lose your text messages and your contacts so let's begin and yeah you'll need an access to a computer and a micro USB cable also your computer needs to be connected to the internet uh, this is the website you need to go to and I will put this link down in the description of this video okay so once you're on this website just scroll down and click on this link Windows Device Recovery Tool uh, wait for the wait for it to download and then install this uh, tool once you've installed it go ahead and launch it and now I'm going to connect my phone this is the micro USB cable which is connected to the computer if it asks for a data connection just click OK and you guys can see it shows that Nokia 730 dual sim has been detected phone is connected it already shows that you have the latest available software but if you check this operating system version and operating system version installed on the phone this is different so let's reinstall the software I know backup and restore won't work because it already says over here. Okay, so now it's gonna download somewhere around 1.73 gigabytes. Uh, it's gonna take a fair bit of time if you have a slow internet connection, so I'm just gonna leave that phone plugged in over here and let it download, and I'll be right back. Alright, guys, so the software download has finished. Now it's installing the software on the phone. The phone switched itself off and you can see it's installing software. And again, do not use your device, do not disconnect the cable, do not switch off the device, otherwise, your device may stop working. Alright, so the installation has finished, the phone is restarting. Uh, you can see it here. And the software shows that the operation has completed successfully. I'm going to click finish and close this. And we're going to wait for the phone to reboot. I should unplug this. If it's successful, we should boot into Windows uh, Windows Phone 8.1. Alright, so 
Let me just perform the initial setup and I'll be right back. Alright, you guys can see we are back to Windows Windows Phone 8.1 Alright guys, so thank you for watching this video and do stay tuned for more videos like this. See you all later.